So um, this ad is sponsored by Anchor. If you haven't heard about Anchor, it's the easiest way to make a podcast. Let me explain. It's free. There's creation tools that allow you to record and edit your podcast right from your phone or computer. Anchor will distribute your podcast for you so it can be heard on Spotify, Apple Podcasts, and many more. You can make money from your podcast with no minimum listenership. It's everything you need to make a podcast in one place. Download the free Anchor app or go to anchor.fm to get started. Hello there. Welcome to Montessori, Creativity and the Meaning of Life. I'm your host, Robin Norgren, and I am doing a series right now on love poems from God, um, featuring 12 sacred voices from the East and the West. And uh, the last um, episode, I began a series on Rumi. So if you want a little more detail about um, his origin story, uh, make sure and go back and listen to the podcast before this one. Uh, but today, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to focus on reading um, some of his poetry. So um, hold on and let's get started. First poem is called With Passion. With passion, pray. With passion, work. With passion, make love. With passion, eat and drink and dance and play. Why look like a dead fish in this ocean of God? Isn't it something? I like when the music plays like this. Something in his eye grabs hold of a tambourine in me. Then I turn and lift a violin in someone else. And they turn, and this turning continues. It has reached you now. Isn't that something? Gainful employment. These just aren't words you are reading. If you churn them, you could have some good cream. If you kept working with my poems, you could open up a shop and sell the finest butter. If you fell in love with Rumi, you could give gainful employment to your family and have fun together hawking my wonderful cheese. Nibble at me. Nibble at me. Don't gulp me down. How often is it you have a guest in your house who can fix everything? And this last one is called That Lives in Us. If you put your hands on this oar with me, they will never harm another. And they will come to find they hold everything you want. If you put your hands on this oar with me, they would no longer lift anything to your mouth that might wound your precious land, that sacred earth that is your body. If you put your soul against this oar with me, the power that made the universe will enter your sinew from a source not outside your limbs, but from a holy realm that lives in us. Exuberant is existence, time a husk. When the moment cracks open, ecstasy leaps out and devours space. Love goes mad with the blessings like my words give. Why lay yourself on the torturer's rack of the past and the future? The mind that tries to shape tomorrow beyond its capacities will find no rest. Be kind to yourself, dear, to 
to our innocent follies. Forget any sounds or touch you knew that did not help you dance. You will come to see that all evolves us. If you put your heart against the earth with me in serving every creature, our beloved will enter you from our sacred realm and we will be, we will be so happy. Thanks so much for stopping by. Be sure to like this podcast on any of your podcast venues, share it with your friends, and uh, give me some feedback on what you think about this series.